All y'all got to do, if y'all want to see if somebody is um, making money, you can't go off of the agency because you can't tell who's making money off the agency. But as far as their Bego career, all you got to do is look at their tap on anybody's name, right? It's going to say how much beans you got, how much you sent out. Now, there are some people who redo their sins to make it look like they don't send out shit. But if you look at a lot of people pages, you will see that they sent, hey, fat wig, you will see that they sent out damn near what they received. That's called trades. That's called you're a bitch or a nigga who can't hit a goal without doing trades. That's, that's, that, that's what that is. It's called trades. Now, hey, it's up to you if you want to take that route. Me, I ain't doing that shit. Bitch, whatever go out here, whatever go out here. I might, I'm, I, I, I'll be okay if I do a little one dragon here, two dragon here, there, whatever type shit. But there's some people who really, literally trade their whole goal. I mean, whatever goal they hit for the month, they literally trade the whole thing. That's fucking stupid because a bitch who's not doing no trades or a nigga who's not doing no trades, they're going to make more money than you because they're getting full profit. So, yeah, I, I don't mind talking about Bego for y'all so y'all can understand more. But a lot of y'all don't understand that there's a lot of money on this app. Like the person Big Ball said, we don't need Bego. Well, clearly you do. If you're not living the way how I live, driving a fucking foreign car, doing this type of shit, bitch, you need to be a host instead of fucking being on a fake page trolling. You need to fucking sign up under somebody's agency and start making thousands of dollars because the people that y'all talking about probably got more money than you and probably make more money than you. There's a lot of money to be made on this app. If you hit $3 million, you're going to get a $24,000 check in your wallet. Plus, I think it's 14000 in tips. It's going to turn out to like $38,000. If you hit $3 million organically, it will turn out to $38,000 in your wallet in one month. I've only hit that one time my whole Beagle career, so I know it's real. When I first got on this app, I did not know you can make money. And then once I found out you can make money, I didn't think the shit was real. But once that money hit my wallet and I, you know, took it out and put it in and it went to, once I, what is it called? Transfer it to my bank and it went in my bank. I said, oh, I'm taking this shit serious. A lot of people don't do that. They literally just be on here for fucking viewers and to get their name out there. That's stupid. That's dumb. And it's so funny because the people used to always call me slow and retarded on the app. But I got the most to show out of everybody. I got the best place, the most expensive car, the most shit, the most designer, the most all that. And they love to have called me retarded. How the fuck am I retarded or slow and I got the most shit to show than the motherfuckers who's calling me slow? No, bitch, I'm the smartest because I actually mastered this fucking app. I saw that it was money to be made on here and I took that money off and I got everything I wanted. That's what I did. I did not just wait. I've been getting shit off of this app since I first downloaded this motherfucker. Some people just now getting stuff or never got nothing still. I've been getting stuff off of this app since I first been on this app. I've always took my money off. Boom, 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 boom. Last week, I took off $5,000. Boom, boom, boom. Once I'm able to take off more, because it take a week for your money to um, hit your bank account. Once I'll be able to pull off more, I'm going to take off another five. I got another 5000 in my wallet. I'll be taking my shit off and I buy what the fuck I want. Because you only live once and this shit ain't going to last forever. So I'll buy anything I fucking want. And if you're making the type of money I'm making um, or even a little bit less, you can still get whatever you want. I literally went to a car lot, bruh. 
and literally just showed them my bank statements and they was like you know what you got some that i think my credit was like it was in high sixes they was like your credit is not bad it's there they was like but your bank statements is what is why we're gonna let you have this car the bank statements bro if you are really pulling money off on this app consistently nobody's going to turn you down nobody nobody's going to turn you down i don't give a fuck if you trying to buy a house i don't give a fuck you trying to get a car i don't give a fuck you trying to get an apartment nobody's going to turn you down if you are pulling money off consistently because it's going to show a direct deposit that's what it's going to show a direct deposit yeah it's going to show a direct deposit that's it that's what it's going to show a high sixes is not bad. Is if you go on any site, it says good. It doesn't say bad. It says good. <laughs> and that's what I had um when I had got my car. So and they gave it to me. Yeah, I know what the fuck I'm talking about. It's not bad. Bad is in the fucking low sixes or five hundreds or four hundreds. My shit said good. They took it, and they took it with the goddamn um, the bank statements. So that's how I got it. Yes, as long as you got that, then you're good. As long as you got that, and you're good. Under six hundred, bad. Yeah, it is. But as long as y'all. Make money on here and take your shit off. You'll be fine. Nobody's going to turn you down. Nothing. It don't matter what you trying to get. Nobody's going to turn you down. My bank statements will give me a proof for any fucking thing. And then since I put so much money down on my car, my credit is even better. But nobody is going to turn you down. Once they see you're making a consistent deposits... And we're talking about thousands of dollars. They're going to approve you for anything. I even got approved for this place off of this fucking shit. Y'all got to realize I'm a dancer. So when you're a dancer, you don't get nothing to show how much you make. You're getting it off of tips. It's just like if you're a waitress working for tips, you don't get nothing that shows how much you make. So when I came here and I told them, hey, I'm a dancer, they didn't care that I was a dancer. They just wanted me to show that I have a job out here. Of course, I work every fucking where. I just went to one of the places, said, hey, I need proof of um, employment. Gave them that and showed them my bank statements with my credit. Boom, I got it. Literally, they called me probably... In 24 hours, it was like a day. They called me back and was like, you're approved. And I got approved with the lowest deposit. I was like, yes. I was like, damn, that's what's up. So I didn't even have to put the highest deposit down. I had to put the lowest deposit. So what I'm saying is Beagle could actually, you know, get y'all whatever y'all want if y'all take it serious. Even now, it's never too late. Like, just host and take the shit serious. Because you can get whatever you fucking want. I always give gems and they never send gifts. That's why I hate talking. I'd rather just be a bing thought on Bigo and just ask for the gifts. Because when I literally be speaking facts and be helping y'all, nobody send gifts. They just fucking be listening. They don't send no gifts. But if I was talking about some drama, talking about I'm about to fight somebody or talking about this nigga did this, thank you, Weezy. They'll be sending gifts. It's weird. To me, the people on Beagle is weird. They pay for drama that's not helping them in the real world. How the fuck is somebody talking shit about somebody helping you in the real world? Nobody comes up and tell y'all shit about Beagle. Nobody. Nobody says, look at what I got off of this app. I'm 
the only motherfucker who does that. Everybody else literally just drags each other and talks shit about each other and y'all send gifts for that. How is that helping you? You know what you're you know what you're really doing? You're sending money. And once we end this live, we're like, well, thanks for the money. You didn't get shit. You literally helped a broadcaster with money. And when we're in the live, you're still in your same, your same world, your same living condition. You're saying whatever the fuck you're doing, you're still in the same position. That person, when they end that live, they're not. They done made money off of you just by being messy. You guys be paying for fucking mess. To me, y'all the dumb ones. I wouldn't be paying nobody for no goddamn mess. Who the fuck gives a fuck? That's stupid. Paying for some drama? And y'all not knowing y'all could watch this shit for free on YouTube? Somebody... Lala or Truth Teller is going to record it. You could just watch it on YouTube. But y'all really be gifting down motherfuckers for bullshit that don't help you. I literally be telling y'all shit. Like, look at this person, not the whole thing. Just get out. You just a waste of... You you just a waste of a human being talking about they don't record the whole thing. Why the fuck fucking care? You just a waste of a human being talking about they don't record the whole thing. Is it that serious? Do you know any of us in the real world? Have you met any of us in the real world? No. How is that helping you? Okay, say for instance, I went live right now and I'm dragging somebody. You're sending me gifts. At the end of the live, you're still in your position and we are up off of the gifts. I will be gifting someone who is really speaking facts and that can help me in the real world. The shit that I'm telling y'all can help y'all in the real world. Why? Because I'm teaching y'all about this fucking app that y'all get on every day and y'all not hosting. That's dumb. Why be on an app where some people are making thousands of dollars more than you and you're not on it? That's dumb. You might as well become a host and get some of this fucking money. I would never be a fucking comment. Somebody who's not a host on an app and I know I'm a million percent sure some of these hosts are fucking making thousands of dollars and they're making more than me. Bitch, you got me fucked up. Where do I sign? That's the difference between me and a lot of these people. I'm all about my bag. I'm all about my money. If I see and I know this is some money right here or right there, bitch, sign me up. Some of y'all are crazy to not become a host. This motherfucker is not going to last forever. It only getting worse and worse. It's getting harder and harder to hit these goals. I remember shit in 2020, bitch, I used to be on 20 boxes, 15 boxes, 35 boxes, 50 boxes. It's only getting harder and harder. Y'all making it worse on y'all selves because about time... By the time y'all actually get on here, it, it ain't going to be nothing. How this money ain't good? You're just going live talking. How? How is this, how is this money on the app not good? Who's to say you're going to be in drama? If you, you want to be in drama, then you will associate with the top host. If you don't want to be in drama, you won't be in drama because we don't know you. You're a fucking fake page. How could you be in drama when we don't know who the fuck you are? Make it make sense. Use your fucking brain. There's no way in hell you would download this app, become a host, and be in drama, and we don't know who the fuck you are. The only way you're going to be in drama is you start talking to the top host. Don't talk to the top host. Don't try and see them in real life. Stick to your fucking self. Worry about yourself. You will not be in no fucking drama.
But if you want to get your name out there and try and have some clout, that's when you're going to be a drama because you're going to have to start talking to everybody that so everybody can see you. Like, what do you mean all money and good money? What's wrong with this app? I ain't selling no pussy. I'm not fucking nobody. I'm not doing shit. How is this money not good? I'm literally going live, making thousands of dollars. I'm not doing no sexual shit. How is this money not good? You're fucking retarded. You are fucking dumb to say that all money ain't good. This app ain't... What? What am I doing? I'm not showing no titties, no pussy, no ass. I'm just talking. Making thousands of fucking dollars. I don't see nothing bad with that. <laughs>